Stuart Haas Racing made it official. Noah Gragson is joining their stable, and he will indeed drive the number 10 vacated by Eric Almirola earlier this year, or at least at the conclusion of the 2023 season. This is the post on X from Stuart Haas Racing. Racing can make you, it can also break you. A new challenge waits, and Noah Gragson is ready to prove himself. Let's ride number 10. Uh, they then have this kind of like minute and a half promotional trailer with Gragson joining the team. We did get a response from Gragson here as well. He shared this video from Stuart Haas Racing. He said, grateful for the opportunity. Looking at the Stuart Haas Racing website, we do have a press release announcing Gragson's uh, tenure at the uh, at Stuart Haas Racing. This is what it says. Uh, it says, Stuart Haas Racing has signed driver Noah Gragson to a multi-year agreement that will see the 25-year-old Las Vegas native pilot the team's number 10 Ford Mustang in the NASCAR Cup Series beginning in 2024. Gragson is a 13-time winner in the NASCAR Xfinity Series, the stepping stone division to the Elite Cup Series, and has made 39 Cup Series starts over the course of two seasons, with a best finish of fifth in the 2022 regular season finale at Daytona International Speedway. And we got this statement from Tony Stewart, NASCAR Hall of Famer and the co-owner of Stuart Haas. He said, Noah deserves to be in the NASCAR Cup Series, and we're very happy to have him as the driver of our number 10 Ford Mustang. Noah has performed at every level where he's competed and has regularly been in championship contention. That's the kind of driver we need at Stuart Haas, and that's why Noah is a part of our team. In four full-time seasons in the Xfinity Series, Gragson finished among the top 10 in points in each year and made it to the championship four twice, finishing third in 2021 and second in 2022 with the series high eight victories. We got a further statement from Gragson here in the press release. He says, I'm grateful for this opportunity with Stuart Haas Racing. And while most people in the industry are happy that the offseason is here, I want to get started on 2024 and go racing as soon as I can. That's why he competed in the Snowball Derby. Stuart Haas is filled with racers, and I see that and felt it as soon as I walked onto the shop floor. There are high expectations here and a strong desire to compete and win races. I have high expectations for myself, and I want to deliver for Tony and Gene and everyone at Stuart Haas. Before joining the Xfinity Series full-time in 2019, Graxkin competed in the NASCAR Truck Series in 2017-2018. He won twice and finished second in the 2018 championship. Those Truck Series results were a continuation of the kind of talent Graxkin showcased in the NASCAR can and Pro Series. In 2015 and 2016, Gragson raced in this development, developmental league, regionally split into two divisions, Canon Pro Series East and Canon Pro Series West. Gragson won six races between the two entities and narrowly missed out on the 2015 West title by a scant seven points. Gragson also owns victories in two of the United States' most prestigious late model races, the 2017 Winchester 400 at Winchester International Speedway and the 2018 Snowball Derby at Five Flag Speedway in Pensacola, Florida. He went on to say, to add, Gragson did, I raced to win and winning at the cup level is what I've been working towards since I started racing Bandoleros as a 13-year-old at the Bull Ring in Las Vegas. To be with an established team with a history of winning is what every driver wants. I've got exactly that here at Stuart Haas, and I aim to make the most of it. Gragson will be paired with crew chief Drew Blickensdurfer. I probably butchered his name there. Forgive me for that. Gragson will make his debut in the number 10 Ford Mustang during the non-point Bush Light Clash at the Coliseum on February 4 at the Los Angeles Memorial Coliseum before kicking off his 36-race slate of points-paying events with the 66 Daytona 500 on February 18th at Daytona. Both events will be broadcast live on Fox and Sirius XM NASCAR Radio. What's interesting is we don't have a sponsor that Gragson will be bringing to the team. Usually they do announce sponsors, so we'll have to wait and see who the primary sponsor for Gragson's number 10 Ford Mustang will be at Stuart Haas Racing. But uh, that is the announcement about Noah Gragson. He has officially joined Stuart Haas Racing. There were rumors obviously going back uh, months and then obviously seemingly was confirmed when he was photographed in the Stuart Haas garage. I think earlier this month. So not a surprise that he has joined Stuart Haas Racing, but it is now official. Let me know what you guys think about Noah Grasson joining Stuart Haas Racing. Leave a comment in the comment section below.